Sorry, dude, that was my fault. I thought you were red. Fucking hell. Typical of me to have a broken gun and fucking team kill again. Hey what's up guys, sorry for my absence during the Christmas period, unfortunately I got very very busy and I decided at New Year's I would restart everything and do it properly again. It was just been very busy at work and at college. Anyway, here is a footage from the Lee and Enfield. Now as the start of it suggests, unfortunately my gun was broken. So the issue is, because when I was doing repairs to the gun, I had to cut the spring because it was too powerful because of the new law about jewels or whatever. Or the rust rules have changed about jewels, not FPS. So I had to cut the spring, which is why it's being temperamental. On top of that, I lost a few screws, so the magazine isn't sitted properly, which means there are a few misfires. Now, I've taken off the scope overlay so you guys can see the bullets. However, the camera doesn't always pick up the bullets as well, because it's actually on the top of the screen rather than centre. Um, I am working to find a good solution for the cameras uh, but for the meantime here's some footage of lean enfield just as a disclaimer um playing with a bolt action iron sight rifle is a very different ball game to sniping i'm relying on my eyes and i'm relying on a gun i'm constantly trying to scope in it is dialed in now but um it's very very difficult so i'm very proud of the four kills i got but um anyway i'll only get better anyway to the footage So the game mode's pretty self-explanatory. We defend three mortar pits with defenders already stationed on them. I am one of those defenders. The rest of the team has to spawn in and reinforce us. Meanwhile, the enemy has to stop capturing the mortars. Pretty self-explanatory, and I'm in a good position. And look at me, I got a kill! Yes, look at that! And yeah, I'm basically, um, yeah, I'm in a good position. I've got two colleagues. Let's go. Hey? Oh yeah, definitely. Oh fuck me guys, I've only got a bolt action. You may notice I've not blurred out the swearing anymore. Please stay tuned to the end of the video to explain why I've changed my video um, editing ways as it were. Uh, oh, where's our respawn, by the way? Okay. So yeah, that's me defending single-handedly the last place. Uh? Luckily they didn't rush me, because otherwise I might yeah. be a bit screwed. But look like I was there, so we're all good. Um, another thing as well, I do have a face cam mount as well, and I'm hoping to use that in the future. As you can see, at certain ranges, it just becomes nearly impossible. Oh, yeah, Again, yeah. I'll get better with time. I'm aiming at a guy, but I'm I'm Wait, still learning. An SSG in that? Yeah. Hit. Oh. Oh, that was a gun hit. Huh? What's your name on YouTube? Scrim Airsoft. No way, it seems to be the video. Really? Yeah. Glad to hear it. Unfortunately, I'm having a bit of a bad day on my gun, but I'm working on it. Yeah, I'm just learning this. Hey? I'm just learning this. Good luck. Huh? Your pistol? Yeah. Lost it. Oh dear. I always love it when people approach me about my videos. It makes it all feel really worthwhile and makes the hobby all the more enjoyable for me. Anyway, here's me going to the tire fort which is the centre of the map. Meanwhile, Noctis has lost his pistol quite humorously. The one that I started off with the P226. Which basically means it's also the camouflage, so you know, good luck to you. Where are they chaps? Oh, 
I still managed to be safe while you're taking it back. Oh, is that a blue? Fuck! So this was about 40 metres away. From, from my point of view, he looked like he was pointing towards us. Evidently on the scope cam that wasn't the case. I do have a bad habit of team killing. I do not mean to do it by any means necessary. I just... Yeah, I'm just going to stop talking. Typical of me to have a broken gun and fucking team kill again. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. Yeah, so I thought that was an airsofter. That was actually a piece of wood. Another reason why I might mount a sight on this. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not totally sure if I got him. I probably didn't. But uh, I think we'll call the video an end there. Luckily, the repair work is pretty easy. I lost a few screws, I replaced them. The mag sits in well enough, and that's that sorted. As for the bolt, I just need to replace the spring, which has been cut, which is already on order. So yeah, everything's going well and dandy. Now, I'm thinking about putting a scope on this and making it permanent sniper. But um, I do like the idea of it being just a bolt action iron sight rifle. I mean, you got to be pretty, <laughs> you got to learn pretty quickly how to use it well. So I think this would be a good challenge for me this year. Now I also mentioned earlier why I haven't blown up the swearing anymore. Obviously, the new copper laws or Cooper or whatever they're called have taken effect on YouTube. Now I've had to think very seriously about how I'm going to play this with YouTube. And long story short, it simulated warfare and violence. So that's why this video has been classified as an adult channel, which is why I'm not blurring or swearing anymore. And I've put a little disclaimer in each of the descriptions. So if you guys are watching this and you're near under 18, please make sure you have per uh, permission from your parents. And it really sucks for me to say that, actually, because I know a fair amount of my audience are younger people. And I love that you come to view the channel and I love that you're interested in the sport. But sadly, I must comply with the law because they can find me, obviously. I don't think I'll get any fines as of now, but um, I have to be really, really careful about this sort of thing. So like I say, if you are watching my videos, make sure you have per uh, permission from your parents. And if you do watch this video, I presume that you do buy the disclaimer written in each of the channel or video descriptions as of this making. Of uh, this video anyway. Some of the videos I need to go back and change the description. But yeah, anyway, that was the footage from the 15th of December. Anyway guys, I'll be hopefully a comm site free on the 12th and the village on the 19th. So I'll see you all there. Until then, leave some love and a sub, and I'll see you guys next time. And remember, leave a like if you like the video, it helps me out enormously, and leave a comment if you were there. Until then, see you all next time.